Howdy guys, we are back with more Final Fantasy VI. Last time we did the opera scene, and now we're going to meet the world's greatest gambler or something. Hmm, business has been awfully slow lately, thanks to the Empire. You're not the only one suffering. The Empire has been toppling towns and villages left and right. They're abusing their Magitek power and trying to take over the world. My kingdom was allied with the Empire, until recently. Maybe you want to be a slave to the Empire, but I sure don't. Dot dot dot, hmm. We're at least together in hating the Empire, right? So, please. You know, I think you may even be even cuter than Maria. Huh? Oh, no, no, she's a tomato here. <laughs> All right, if you... if Celeste becomes my wife, I'll help you. Otherwise... Oh, Block's like, what? What, what, what? Are you crazy? He's so not into this. Fine. Oh, great. It's settled. I, you know, I like Celeste. She's just... she does what she has to do to move forward, right? She just... It, she... nothing stops her. Just... she moves in one direction forward. I think she's awesome. I think she's a cool character. But I have some conditions. Uh-oh. Whisper, 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 nod. We flip this coin. If it's heads, you help us. If it's tails, I'm yours. Well, Mr. Gambler, <laughs> I like it. I accept. Celeste, are you serious? If you marry that guy... Is this like a trick coin or something? Ready? Uh-oh, here it goes. What did it land on? I'm hoping it's a trick coin. Heads, I win. Now it's time for you to hold up your end of the bargain. Was it a trick coin? A valuable trinket indeed. I've never seen a double-headed coin before. <laughs> I guess that's the nature of gambling. You've got to know what you're gambling with before you bet on something, right? He just got screwed. <laughs> that coin? Edgar, don't tell me. I'm afraid you've been hustled, Mr. Gambler, but that's part of the game now, isn't it? Oh, I like her. She's a... she is... ooh, she's sharp. I like her. I really just... oh, I just have such a big girl crush on Celeste now. <laughs> How low can you stoop? I love it. Alright, I'll help you. Gambling against the Empire with nothing to lose but my life? I haven't felt so excited in years. <laughs> My life's a chip in your pile. Annie up. I like this guy. I liked I liked all of it. That was so cool. Oh my gosh, Celeste is too awesome. She is so cool. She, you know that you know cuz Tara feels like such kind of like maybe I I obviously don't know because I haven't played very much, but Tara seems so weak in comparison with Celeste now. You know, she just seemed so helpless, but I guess we'll see how her story develops. That maybe that's part of it. Anyway, I can't believe this clunky old thing can fly. You sure it'll stay in the air? <laughs> when things fall, they fall. Life's a game of chance. You play your cards, and fate plays hers. They'll spot us in the air from miles away if we try to fly this thing into the Empire. We'd better land a safe distance away. That sounds like a good idea. I'll stay on board and keep the ship ready to take off at a moment's notice. I thought he was going to come with us. Ooh. Oh, we're doing this weird camp map camera thing again. This is like like 3D, not 3D, kind of. I mean, like, A for effort, it's kind of cool. I'm not trying to hate, but <laughs> I really regret that I didn't play the game um, in the 90s when it came out. I feel like I would have a bigger appreciation for little bits like this, because right now I'm just hating. Alright, so it looks like I can go to this village, but there's something on the... where I'm supposed to go is red on the map. It says, travel to Vector. But there's a town right here I want to expose. Oh, Albrook. They're occupied by the Empire. Obey the Empire. Alright, let's... Oh, the house is damaged. Do you see the roof? Oh, everything's damaged here. 
let's see, item shop. I'm pretty well equipped, or well um, supplied. Maybe I need a few more remedies and a couple more of these. Um, can't have too many of these, to be honest. Um, let's see, tele that might be a something I might want to have a few more of, but I'm pretty happy. Oh my gosh, look how many high potions I have. I've been stealing like crazy on lock, so I feel like I'm good on curatives for now, which is good because now I can spend my gill on new treasures and upgrades and whatever. What do you have to say? Welcome to Albrook, the occupied city. Gosh. There's something important on the eastern edge of the continent. The Imperials built an observation post there and won't let anyone beyond it. Ooh, I can't wait to check that out. We have to bribe the Imperial soldiers or they won't let us do business here. It's in our own city. Defy us and you'll regret it. Ah, oh, they're all drunk off their own power, huh? I love this music. Sheesh, those soldiers think they own this place. The pub's pretty much an imperial clubhouse these days. Gosh, I'd shut the place down. Oh my gosh, look at all the girls up here. Oh my god, they're all drunk and dancing. How What a ra rowdy place. Rowdy place. You probably don't even have any money. Uh, you see how much gill I'm packing here, lady? Hey, you're not an imperial. Get out of here. Welcome! <laughs> oh man, all these floozies just turned over to the Empire as soon as they could. <laughs> I think I've had a bit too much. <laughs> She's wasted. Shove off, can't you see I'm busy? Hey, baby! Woo woo! Oh, they're like whistling. Yeah, baby! Woo woo! Ooh, and they're all dancing up there. I don't know if I would want to be dancing for anyone that just, you know, obliterated my town and ruined everyone's livelihood, probably killed and destroyed everyone I love, but, you know, I guess whatever you gotta do to survive, is it survival at this point? I'm not sure. Uh, maybe it is. I don't know. I've never been in that situation. Hope I never will be living in an occupied town must suck ass. Amulet. Protective charm worn around the neck prevents poison. I'll grab, uh, at least, it, it probably doesn't hurt to have at least one of those. Like, I like to have one of everything, but I have so many cool relics as it is. You know, it's hard to pick and choose what to use. The port's off limits. Shove off, can't you see I'm busy? You can find excellent weapons and armor in the shops in Zen to the north and Miranda to the west. Alright, so basically not here is what he's saying. Twist headband. I've got six of those from er, from how many I've stolen. Um, maximum MP. That might be nice. I'll grab one of those. And, um, yeah, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty happy with the equipment that I have on everyone right now. Empty. Empty. I wonder if I waited later on in the game if those would have had something better instead of me opening them now or maybe an event or something. I don't know. Emperor just all commissioned a painting, but what kind of painting should I do? Oh man, I'd hate to friggin' be an art. You know, that must be horrible to be an artisan from in your somewhere where you've been captured or occupied. You have to do whatever the your captors say, you know, make them a beautiful painting or a sculpture, and oh, you just gotta hate them, so oh, must be terrible. I study monsters. The ones on this continent seem to be exceptionally vulnerable to magic. Hint, 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 I guess. <laughs> Alright, uh, probably nothing too exciting in here, but I can look around for a bit. Why not? Um, nope, nothing exciting. Maybe I should stay. 300 gil per night, let me see. I don't know. No, I'm in pretty good... No, I'm in good shape. I don't need to rest. Um, hmm. Yeah, I guess there's nothing really else to check out here but the Empire's destruction of the town, really. Let's see, what about you? The Imperial capital of Vector is right at the center of this continent. Alright. <laughs> I don't know why I made her sound like that. Alright, well, I... Unless I'm completely blind, which I don't think I've been over and around here. Oh yeah, I haven't been in here. Let's check this place out. What do you have to say? Oop, oop. I'm a scholar of ancient weaponry. Two weapons, known as Ultima weapons, were used during the War of the Magi a thousand years ago. One was a sword whose blade sprang from its wilder strength. The other was a monster born for destruction. Okay, cool. 
And, ooh, okay. All right, here's the upgrades. All right, let's get one of these. And I'll grab one of these just because I've learned not to... Oh, Sakura. A ninja sword imbued with the power of wind. Made for thrusting. Let's just get three of these then, why not? And this is all throw stuff for the feller I don't have even have in my party. Here, let's see if any of that is an upgrade. There we go. Bastard sword. Bur oh! Oh, derp! That was a derp. Okay, I should have... Alright, well, that was poison. What does the burning fist do? Ooh, knuckles that may cast fire. Well, gosh, I wish I had... I, I forgot I picked that up in, what, Zozo or something? I'm just like, yeah, I don't need those. Whatever. Well, I don't need what I... Oh, man, I wish I could, like, dual-wield weapons. <laughs> oh, well, um... I think it probably wouldn't be worth it for the defense loss, even if I could. Um, oh gosh, I didn't realize she was completely unarmed. It's a good thing I came in here, I guess, because I had the... Let's see, what did I have on her? I had, uh, sorry guys, give me one second. I had the gaunt, yeah, I really liked that on her. And, um, gosh, there's so many... Look how many of these spectacles I have. I have 13 of them. I think I liked that, but I don't know. I haven't really been using magic on her, so maybe one of these might be nice. Oops, I don't know. There's like so many. I, I really want to play with that. The attack command to jump. That actually might be kind of fun for her to avoid damage since she's my only healer, but I don't know how much I'm going to have her actually just sit there and hit attack. She, she's going to be needing to be a caster at some point. Let's just do that. Hero's ring is good. I think this is fine. I'm not sure. I really should change some of this around. I think I have, do I have, I have two sprint shoes on here. Let's fix that. I forgot I put that, those on lock for the, the, uh, uh, opera thing there. I want to do, oh yeah, like this one, mug. There we go. It may not be the best, but I'm happy with it, so whatever. All right, moving right along. Oh, you know what? Um, let's see. I don't know if that is a knife that sometimes steals from an enemy. I don't know. I've got he's got so many cool different weapons. I don't know what to use. Hmm. That gives him a lot of evasion. Huh. No, I'm pretty I think I think I'm happy with what I have. Sorry guys, sorry, sorry, sorry. Alright, let's talk to you. You can find oh okay, no no no, I've already talked to him. Alright, I don't think I have anything else to do in this town, so Let's head over to a Vector then, which is just a quick... I don't know if I should check out the other towns now, or just go ahead and head over there. Um, ooh, some new kinds of mobs here, so that's kind of interesting, a little different. Ooh. Oh, you know what I should have done? I should have maybe checked out one of those uh, espers or whatever. I really don't know if I should go straight to Vector or if I should check out some of the other towns first. Oh, ooh, okay, hmm, choices, and there's, it looks like there's a town to the far north, I bet I probably can't pass up that way, I'm guessing there's things in the way, so let me save right here real fast, and go on in, why not? Vector, playing some sad music as soon as you walk in, haven't you, haven't seen you around here before, why don't you go climb back down over whatever hole you crawled in? Oh, people here aren't very friendly. Stay the high at night. It's on the house. Why is it on the house? <laughs> I don't want to know why it's on the house. I think I'm going to stay here and apply to become a soldier. I'm tempted to stay the night because I want to know why it's on the house. In the same army that destroyed our village? What about your promise to start over in Miranda? Oh my gosh, what is this place? I'm, I'm, like, this... Being able to spend the night on the house freaks me out way more than it should. I'm really tempted to do it. Like, I mean, it's free. I might as... Okay, I'm gonna do it. Why not? It's free. Okay, sure. We're gonna wake up, like, ball... Or ball gag in our mouth, tied up. Some freaky stuff's gonna happen to us. <laughs> okay, nope. Everything was normal. All right, okay. <laughs> I don't know why I was like freaking out so hard about that. Alright, I've already talked to that guy. Alright, this place has got like a lot more like concrete and metal and oh gosh, I don't know if I want to talk to those guys over there. They look pretty serious. What about you? Shh, I'm a returner. I've heard all about you. Uh oh. I'll distract the soldiers. Use this box to climb onto those steel beams and sneak into the research facility. 
Are you ready? No! Oh my gosh, I'm not ready for all this. I want to look around a little bit more. Oh, here's a little kid. And cure! Okay. Sid, the direct- Ooh, hey, there's a- I was wondering where Sid was. Sid, the director of Magitech Research, is a genius! He gave my son the gift of cure magic. That's a pretty good one to have. Ooh. I heard General Celeste went over to the Returners. Why join this side that has no hope of winning? She's like right here, dude. What are you talking about? Okay, nothing- Nothing I don't already have in here. And... Oh my gosh. I just feel so depressed walking around this place. I don't- the, the music feels oppressive. You. Your returners. Whoopsie. I shouldn't have gone and give him a, given him a high five. I don't know if I can deal with them or not. I hope I can. Let's mug this guy, see if he's got anything good. Good old blitz here. Couldn't steal. Bummer. Alright, let's do, um, hmm. I kind of want to see what the- let's see what this looks like. Why not? Might as well use it, just to see what it's like. Um... Okay. <laughs> that was kind of goofy. I'm not gonna complain. Oops, I think I screwed that up. That was kind of funny, though. Ooh, stole a potion. I'm probably, like, maxed out on potions. Oh, that was kind of a waste. Okay, good, good thing I did a bit of grinding, I think. Alright. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Are we being chased out of town? That was close. Okay, so I can't walk near the guards, which sucks because I wanted to check that out over there. I'm gonna... Because I'm pig-headed, I'm gonna go back anyway. Okay, I just... Alright, I just straight up can't go over there, I guess. How about you? What do you think? General Leo's never had a Magitech infusion. He's a warrior's warrior. Oh, man, you know, we're gonna have to fight against him, aren't we? Which really sucks because he's just like... I feel like he's a... Uh, General Leo's a good person that's just on the wrong side, basically. Or, you know, he's... He's gonna be some... He's gonna be interesting to deal with, I think. Alright, so I don't want to go charging headlong into them. Alright, yep, 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 yep. I guess I'm ready then. Use this box to climb onto the steel beams and reach and sneak into the... Alright. Let's do it. Are you ready? Yes. Oh, he's doing his little goofy dance here. Thanks, buddy. Oh, must have had a few too many. <laughs> Alright, how do I... I'm supposed to use this box. How am I supposed to do it? Hold on, I'm having an... Alright, I, I, am I really this daft? Okay, I am. Alright, hop up here. Run over here. And hope they don't look up. Oh, I'm gonna toss it all. Oh, jeez. Good old man there. Thanks, buddy. Thanks for the help. The assist. <laughs> In we go. Oh my gosh, this is cool. Alright, do I go this way? I guess I do. Alright, Magitech Factory. Oh gosh, this is- oh, okay, this is gonna be a dungeon, huh? Alrighty, so, um, let's, uh, let's- I wanna try out some of the other espers. Let's do this Kirin and, uh, Holy Aura. Ooh. Ooh, that looked cool. Alright, and it kind of re re oops, oops, wrong button. Alright, Siren. Let's see what Siren looks like. I just want to do each of them. Just for, Oops, if I stop fat finger in the escape button. And of course, our buddy Rama. You can only use them once per fight. Oh, she's cool. Alrighty. And then, I think that... Ooh. And then Judgment Boat. Ooh, good old... Ooh! Seizurific, wasn't that? <laughs> Very flashy. Alright, so I'm a big fan of Rama, and the uh, Kirin one actually isn't bad. The health regen's not awful on it, honestly. I don't think it's terrible. It's really not. Alright, so we got a dungeon on our hands here. Locke learned Cure, Locke learned Libra. What? Edgar lo learned Poison. So is that from the espers I have equipped on them, that they learned these abilities? Okay, yeah, he sh Oh, huh. Huh, that's really interesting. So you can end up with some really goofy combinations of- Oh my god, this game is so cool! Is that how the espers work? You learn all these spells from them? Oh my gosh, this game is amazing! Oh my god, where am I? Did my- What's going on here? Is this a glitch or something? 
Where? What? I'm stuck. I can't move. I think my game glitched, maybe? You guys see this too, right? Um... Well, shoot. I don't know what to do here. Um, let me try reloading here. That was a thing. Oh, gosh. I don't know what to do. Head in deeper. Uh... 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 I am stuck. Okay, I, I think I might have really screwed up by quick saving too. Oh jeez, I don't know what to- Alright, I will be right back, guys. Alrighty, guys, I had to load an old- They're my last save from the overworld, and- Oops, because I tried exiting the game, and that like weird screen glitch was still there. I don't know what caused it, but I kind of see why this uh, game got negative reviews on uh, Steam. Like, little glitches like that, you know, if, you know, oh my gosh, I'm just, like I said, I'm just so glad I didn't lose my progress. I was really worried, but I have, you know, I had my save file, and it's not just the auto save, and I went ahead and saved in, like, every file location in case anything glitchy like that happened again, because that, yeah, see, everyone just learned all this stuff from my last, see, now it's back to normal, but my gosh, can y'all believe that glitch? That was something, wasn't it? Oh my gosh. I don't even know how I feel right now about about that. Oh gosh, I don't know where to go in this place. Be right back! But yeah, that was really gnarly how like the whole screen, like, I'm really hoping that doesn't happen again where all the pixels are smashed in together, and my goodness, I have no clue where to go in this place. It's a mess! I feel like I need to do something with that, that grappling hook, mate, or that, there we go, that's what I needed to do. Oh, okay, I just, alright, alright, ooh, treasure, oh, I can't drive with it. Ooh, flame tongue, that's a weapon, isn't it? I want to put that on my girl here. Let's see, flame tongue, yeah, awesome. Oh my gosh, I'm getting so much more excited with all the cool new abilities you get in this game, it's so neat. I'm still so hopeless, oh, oh, what the heck? <laughs> okay, that's, um, okay, that doesn't help my situation any. I'm still so hopelessly lost, um. Oh, okay, I go through there. Alright, that's how we do it. It's like we're on a little assembly line here or something. This is crazy. An X potion? Good. Maybe I can get some treasure in here. Alright, the random encounters don't see. Oh, I got trolled. I'll be back. Alrighty, I'm back d Ooh, Thunderblade. I'm back down kind of where I was and, um,. Grabbed a little bit of treasure along the way that I missed, but I'm still pretty oops, hopelessly lost in this place. It's going to be an awfully big adventure in here, isn't it? You know, I'm not very sure if the espers I have on the people I have them on now are like the best setup, but I figure I can probably always just uh, change them off if I want someone to learn a different spell, right? Because I don't know how useful Locke is going to be with the heals, but I don't know, maybe he will, maybe they, maybe it turns out it's pretty good, I don't know. Gosh, the only thing is, I'm not sure how big this place is. Oh my gosh, another random encounter. And I'm just uh, worried that... Ooh, Zephyr Cloak. I'm... Ooh, oh my gosh, so many cool treasures. I just don't want the episode to go on too long, you know, so... I'm... Oh no, you can fall off? Oh my gosh, this place is so troll. Yeah, I feel like I'm probably gonna be in here for a while, so I don't know if I should stop here or if... Ooh, these guys do some really crazy stuff. I don't know if I should stop here for now or if I should keep going or if y'all are gonna watch me get wiped out by that uh, big damage ability he just did. <laughs> so many... Oh my gosh, yeah. An extra healer is nice, I'm not gonna lie, so I'm kind of glad that I- I don't know if Locke's the right idea, but I don't know, I'd rather have Sabin and Edgar attacking, so I think Locke is the second best choice to have heals. Maybe I'm wrong, but it's working out for me. Um, I don't know if maybe I should cut out all of me wandering around aimlessly because I'm really bad in dungeons and I'll get lost like crazy and I don't know how exciting that will be to watch. <laughs> so, um... Gosh, I guess I'll be back until I find something exciting. I'll be right back, guys. 
Alrighty, I went down the little machinery line there and then heard Kefka giggle, so I threw my recording back on. I'm a god! I'm all powerful! <laughs> I'll collect more espers, I'll extract their magic, and then. <laughs> I'll revive the warring triad! <laughs> He likes- he's a, such a happy guy, he, li he likes to laugh. Uh-oh. Ooh, that's like, uh... Maybe that's Rama and Shiva, maybe? I've already drained all your powers, you are useless to me now! Oh. Oh. Maybe they're not- maybe they're just random espers. You two, take a hike! Oh my gosh. I don't even know if those are who I said that just- judging by what they look like. Oh my god, he just rolled them off into nothingness. Oh, jeez. When you didn't think this guy could get even more evil, he goes and acts more evil. Alright guys, I think that might be a good enough stopping point because this episode's gonna be so long and I didn't realize this dungeon was so huge. So, we'll continue working our way through the Magitech factory next time. Thank you guys so much for watching me play Final Fantasy VI. I'll see you next time. Bye for now!